This is Jay at Greybeard. It's now July 1st. It's been a couple of months since I've last done a video. My wife and I were walking the Camino de Santiago de Compostela over in Spain. She was quite successful at it, 500 miles. I only made 300 miles for my knees gave out. I'm still okay with that. Got home to a hoo-hoo real mess up here at the farm. Uh, Brett and Amy, um, I appreciate their efforts in beating back the weeds. And I spent the last three days just to get it to here, so I got a lot more to do. Anyway, here's the four rows of asparagus. Uh, we let it go straight to fern, didn't pick any of it. These ferns will get another, I don't know, two feet taller. And we let them stay until brown. Try to weed them as we go. I have um, sunflowers at the head and foot of each of these rows. Uh, initially, just to remember where the rows were, but obviously the ferns came up and took care of that for me. Bees are still here. I think this is a second generation of them. Blueberries haven't done anything yet. I think they'll survive, but I don't know about a crop this year. That's my corn down there. Corn, beans, and squash. Beans didn't do really well, because um, I think I planted them too soon before the corn was up and the beans didn't have anything to climb up. Had a bad problem with Japanese beetles. But I put up some of these spectricide bag of bugs, which, hell, I put that up yesterday and it's already full. Um, got one there and one at the other end of the corn. They work really well. Just got finished putting down some di diatomaceous earth and some seven dust. Still got a couple of Japanese beetles. You can see up there, I like it. Head them off before they take another foothold. There were thousands of them here. Pretty much beat them back though. Uh, my corn is tasseling out nicely. Uh, you can see the bean um, flowers coming up also. That's the purpose of these as you plant the beans at the root of the corn and they will climb up the corn as a support. And then also plant a squash in the middle of each of these mounds. Half of those didn't come up, some did. The purpose of that, that's the big wide leaves, is uh, to shade the ground to keep the uh, weeds to a minimum. So these are um, straight neck squash, I believe. But the corn is tasseling out nicely. Probably won't do much eating on those. The whole purpose of the garden this year is to grab seed for next year. I want to make sure that I got that process down. These um, sunflower heads will go to the chickens after I save some seed. Grapes did miserably this year after that frost right before I left, so I've just let them go. I'll probably have to replant the grapes. This is the other Japanese beetle trap you can see is pretty full. And whatever variety of uh, this grape did better, they actually started going to grape a little bit. Um, but between the bugs and the frost and, and that, it's just, it was a mess. My herb garden did 70% uh, pretty good. The veggie garden's doing well. I got a Atlantic pumpkin here that has a pretty nice one on it already. I got some shade up for it. That's gonna be my Halloween pumpkin. The seed that that came from came from a 270 pound pumpkin. Oh, rosemary, comfrey, lemon balm. There's a whole bunch of different herbs that have come up pretty nicely. There's only a few that didn't come up at all. Peppers, daikon radishes, they're huge radishes. Um, my, uh, Hale's Best Melon. You can see a couple of melons coming up, one on the other side. Nice big one there. One on the ground. I'll come do some better training here shortly. These are going to be artichokes. Oh, 
tomatoes, cherry tomatoes, I believe. They're already starting to come up nicely. The uh, garlic didn't come up at all, but the ginger root did. All four of those came up. One in the pot, three in the ground. Um, cucumbers, got some more training to do, but there's quite a few cucumbers on there already. Some ones ready for picking. Turmeric didn't come up at all. Um, heirloom tomatoes. Onions, I didn't really plant. I planted three onions, two are coming up not really well. And my watermelon didn't come up at all. What's left for me to do today is my tea garden. I got three tea plants and some marigolds and nasturtiums in there. I gotta weed, weed out the rest of that. And my little cart's working really well. Takes me up and down the aisles uh, on a swivel seat where I can do some weeding and, and uh, picking and that kind of stuff. That's it. Um, give me another month or so, I'll put up another video. Thanks for your time.